really teach you how to be independent, how to manage your own like class load and like learn how to deal with like more advanced classes. They expect more and they push you to be better. And that's the support that I always needed and that they can offer. To make it at CMC, you gotta work hard. You just give it your best and ask questions. So that's the most important thing. If you don't ask questions, you're just gonna be stuck. First year here, they put you through some college prep classes which are more challenging than regular high school classes and you got to learn how to deal with that and to manage your workload so when you do get into the college aspect of the program pathways or CEO you're prepared for it and it's a lot of knowing when your classes are knowing to come prepared for class knowing to get your work done early and uh, just being able to manage your own time basically it's college is a lot different than high school and this high school really helps make that transition which most don't all of our students start out in building and then we have so you're taking all your in building regular classes and then we have a nomination process to where about 20 to 25 students get nominated to go to what we call our pathways program if you got accepted you would start the next term and that's when you have your set classes they choose them for you you have your basics communication you have your spanish 101 and your writing class so they're getting their college credits and then high school credits. Then after that, those three trimesters, three pathways, one full year of pathways, they then go on up to being a CEO student and what that is is a full-time college student. After the three terms were over, um, if you succeeded them well, you got to move on to the next term. At the end of every term, you have like a meeting with your counselor and they go over everything. They go over your grades, what you want to take, how your classes were, how you're adjusting. They ask you all those questions. And if you're like struggling, it's not a big deal. Like it's not a big deal. They, the whole point of the college prep classes your freshman year and your pathways to college is to prepare you and get you ready. It was, it was different because um, sophomore year, we were, yes, taking college classes, but we had the classes that they set out for us. So 25 of us students were um, in the college class. As a program, we stay together for three terms. After those three terms, you choose your own courses, you break apart. And the nice thing about it is since they're taking the CCC, these credits are transferable to any public university in the nation, which is, I mean, that's nice for wherever you decide to go. They may still have some classes here, but usually it's just full time. And then we provide transportation up there for them. We have a bus shuttle. We provide textbooks. But it's a great deal. <laughs> it's a, I mean, it's amazing. You could graduate CMC without having to take any college courses, just as a regular high school. Oh, I just turned like 19 or whatever, and they're like, wait, but you came in with 85 credits. You just graduated high school, and they're so confused. And I'm trying to tell people, like, I try to tell people about this school as much as I can, and I feel like this is incredibly helpful, but... It, it changed my opinion, because I now feel like, you know, even though I'm just a, just a teenager, I know that I can still make a difference, you know? I don't have to be an adult yet to make a difference. I just have to go out there and do something. Um, it's a great place. It's, it's a great place to be as a staff member. It's a great place to be as a student. They notice if you're upset, they notice if when you're getting mad, they notice when you're um, struggling outside of school and it's affecting your schoolwork. If your grade starts dropping, they pay attention, they pull you out and they talk to you about what you can do, how you can stay afloat and what you can do to make it better. Our students work really hard and we know they do. I mean, it's rigorous work, but we celebrate them. You know, last year we took them snow tubing. We took them to the winter hot scene. We took them ice skating. The year before we had karaoke come in here. We do activity days, because we know they work hard. So it's like, well, we're gonna celebrate that. Each term, we, at the end of it, we go on a field trip. And normally at the end of our fall term, we go ice skating. Like those interactions make us more united as a school. That's why we refer to each other a lot like family because we, we're like together all the time. It's, we're just so close.